As many of you already know, rents here in Southern Nevada have gone up significantly, specifically for many businesses, just like this coffee shop. Just in the past nine years, retail rents have nearly doubled the national average. I'm Ibo Garcia sitting down with some local business owners to find out how this impacts you, the consumer. Absolutely. Um, I will tell you. JJ Wiley has been whipping up specialty coffee drinks and breakfast treats at Grouchy John's Coffee, serving the Las Vegas community since 2010. I love this community and it has done a lot to sustain me. But lately, Wiley's passion to serve hit a roadblock. They're asking for rents that just aren't feasible for a business our size. Wiley says last year a high rent increase is what forced him to close his third location here in the valley. By how much were they planning they, to raise your rent? They wanted to raise the rent 20%. Wow. CoStar, a commercial real estate information company, tells Channel 13 that rent increases in the valley have been higher than the national average for nine straight years. With an average retail rent growth of 6.6%, Las Vegas is ahead of the curve, leaving the national average of 3.6% in the dust. Wiley also says food service margins are razor thin at his other two locations. So he says changes had to be made, which affect all of us. We have raised our prices, you know, 20, 25% uh, on some items, and uh, unfortunately more, more uh, price rises are coming. It's a shame it's, it's, it's got to trickle down to the little guy. At Wiley's Coffee Shop, I met Red Rudder, a regular who noticed the increase in prices. Makes you question whether you want to go out and have a cup of coffee, have some lunch, have a bite to eat, versus stay at home and just cook and make coffee at home. But Wiley is not alone. Business owner Victor Botneri is also feeling the pinch. He says he wants to expand his auto service business to another location, but is struggling with the rental prices. The rents are like from 20, 25,000 and up. Wow, and that's a month. A month. A month. 25,000 a month. Exactly, a How month. How much are you paying here at this location? Uh, for this location, I'm paying around 6,000. Red Rudder says it's these businesses we need to take care of. The big stores are the big stores, but the little guy, the little guy needs that support. JJ tells me that especially during these difficult times, small businesses just like his rely heavily on the support from our community. Reporting from Enterprise, I'm Ibo Garcia.